Taking a train is the best way to experience Sri Lanka. This journey shows you the landscape, history and the culture of Sri Lanka. So the train leaves quite early from Colombo Fort. Kandy is the perfect first stop. It's the site of the last Sinhalese kingdom. It has the famous botanical gardens in Perdenia. So you are welcome to the Royal Botanic Gardens Kandy. These gardens are 645 years old, known as one of the most beautiful botanic gardens in the world. We have got approximately 4,000 different plant species here and almost 60% are indigenous to Sri Lanka. And many plant species including tea and rubber as well as cloves, cocoa, were introduced to Sri Lanka through these botanic gardens. The Dalada Maligawa is known as the Temple of the Truth. It's a very spiritual place for all Buddhists and inside is an ancient relic, Buddha's Tooth. The great thing is you could arrive at your destination, explore, stay the night and move on the following day. There's a lot of life on a Sri Lankan train. There are people playing music, playing games, there are food vendors. It's an amazing experience. When you arrived in Hatton, you are in Hill Country. Near Hatton is the famous mountain, Adam's Peak or Sri Pada. Because of the biodiversity, it's named as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Most of the time, those forests are covered with mist. It's we are calling cloud forest. Adam's Peak is a very special place. It's significant to all religions. It's one of the most important pilgrim sites in Sri Lanka. Travelers also retrace the pilgrim steps to see the beautiful views from the top. It's a hard walk, but it's worth it. New Orleans is a piece of heaven. Some way we call Little England because of the cool climate. The British were here in the 19th century and also introduced tea. They built railways to do the transportation of the tea. The tea tastes much better in New Orleans. My name is Kalaiwani. I'm coming from New Orleans. Because of the cool climate, we can make a delicate fragrant tea from here. This is a tea leaf. This is the way to pick. Just two leaves and a bud. I like to drink tea. For a day minimum, I drink five, six cup of tea. Really, I like tea. In New Orleans, there are a lot of remnants of the British architecture. One of the key highlights is the red brick post office in the heart of the town. and 
like one of the best golf courses in Asia. The New Delhi Golf Course was founded in 1889 and it's the third oldest golf course outside Britain. It was for the, uh, for the British soldiers who fought in the war and subsequently became for most of the planters. The highlight of the train journey from Colombo to Alla is from Nanu railway station to Alla. The trains creep through the uh, mist-capped mountains, the estates and tunnels. Taking the train is like an opening up an encyclopedia for the local lifestyle and culture. Alla may be the end of the railway line, but it is not the end of your exploration. It opens doors to a new area of natural beauty called Bellavaya.